Hey everyone, it's Natasha of natashaskitchen.com and I am so excited to share with you our favorite go-to autumn salad. It is a broccoli grape salad and wait until you see the dressing. It's literally four ingredients and it is lip smacking good. To get started, we're gonna make some bacon and toasted pine nuts. Place a medium saute pan over medium heat and add six ounces of chopped bacon. Saute until browned all over, then remove it to a plate with a slotted spoon. Toast a quarter cup of pine nuts in a small pan over medium heat, tossing often until they're lightly golden and fragrant. And it really takes just a few minutes to toast nuts, so keep an eye on them so they don't burn, and transfer them to a separate dish to cool to room temperature when they're done. You'll need one pound of broccoli crowns. Finally, chop them up into small bite-sized pieces and transfer them to your salad bowl. Next, thinly slice half of an English cucumber or you can use a couple of smaller garden cucumbers. Transfer those to the bowl with your broccoli. You'll need one and a half cups of seedless grapes. You can use red or green grapes for this. And it's easiest to cut them in half using a serrated knife. Transfer the grapes to the salad bowl, then chop one quarter cup of red onion. And I like to finely chop the onion so it adds great flavor and disappears into the salad. Add your finely diced onions, your toasted pine nuts, and your browned bacon to the bowl. That's it for the salad, and now we're on to the dressing. All you need is half a cup of mayo, one tablespoon of fresh lemon juice, a quarter teaspoon of salt or salt to taste, and a quarter teaspoon of black pepper. All right, just stir that until it's completely creamy and smooth. And look at that, it is such a good dressing. You guys are gonna love this. And if you are anti-mayo, I get it, whatever. <laughs> Even though this is really, really good the way it is, and this is how we love it, you could substitute with sour cream or Greek yogurt or whatever. <laughs> but try it this way first because it's really good. And make sure, make sure you use the fresh lemon because it brightens up the dressing and makes it super yummy. Okay. Now that the dressing is made and our salad is prepped and ready to go, all that's left to do is to pour the dressing over, toss everything to combine and serve this. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. And you can add the dressing to taste. And I personally like to use every last bit of dressing, but maybe that's just me. Okay, and then just toss until everything is evenly coated in that luscious, creamy dressing. and that dressing gives every bite amazing flavor. Okay, that looks really good. And time to serve it up. Okay, generous portion for me because this is lunch. <laughs> oh, this is definitely a hearty and filling lunch or side salad, whatever. <laughs> okay, here we go. A little bit of everything because everything in here is good. Mm. 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 I love that combination of sweet, little bit of salty with the bacon, oh, and tangy from the dressing. The lemon mm, it is, just pulls everything together and makes each ingredient really pop. And I love the toasted pine nuts in there. It is such a treat. But you can also use seeds. Just make sure to toast them because it really amps up their flavor. And the sweet, juicy grapes. Oh, this is just a winning, winning combination. And this is a really great potluck salad. Just make sure you don't mix the dressing in until you're ready to serve it. But you can make the dressing, make the salad, put it together, and you've got a party. <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome. Hey, by the way, if you're looking to improve your cooking skills, I made a free course and I'll link to it in the description so you guys can get your hands on it. Make sure you sign up and we'll see you in our next video.